Welcome to part two of the job order video. You can verify a new job order by going to the job order list in the left menu under the job order section. All new job orders are automatically placed in the in progress tab. When using the goods issued or goods receipt menus, you'll notice that there's a job order button that allows you to load existing job orders. It's important to note that the job order orders can only be loaded if they're in the In Progress tab. So if you've moved them to the Finish tab, they will not appear in those two respective menus. Once you're finished with a job order, you can move it to the Finish tab by going to the Complete column and click on the Finish button. Click OK. And now it's in the Finished tab. You can revoke the Finished status by going to the complete column again and clicking cancel. You can verify the stage of manufacturing by job order by going to the manufacture status column, click print, and you'll view the manufacture status by job order. If you'd like to modify or delete a job order, you can do so by clicking on the job order number slip Modify the data, and then when you're done, click Save. If you'd like to delete the job order, you can go to the lower right corner and click on the Delete button. If you'd like to submit a job order for approval, simply select the job order, and then click E-Approval. You can learn more by watching the E-Approval video. If you'd like to customize the overview screen that you see here, you can easily do so by clicking Option in the upper right corner and then click on the Settings List button and you'll be able to modify it. Click Save when you're done. To create job order reports, go to the lower left side of the screen to the Report section and click on the Job Order Status button. You can enter the information and then click Search and you can view the job order status information. If you'd like to modify this template, you can do so by clicking search and then the option button will appear and then click on the template button. If you'd like to view a progress status by job order, you can click on the progress status by job order report, click search, also, if you click on the Advanced tab, you can select the type of progress status report you'd like, production progress, goods issued progress, or standard versus actual usage status. Then click Search. Thank you for watching part two of the job order video.